Hey, it's Dean Parnassus, the ultra marathon man. And what's the dealio, Delio? Hey everybody, Leah here, and I am at the LA Convention Center for the expo for the 24th annual LA Marathon, which is happening tomorrow, Memorial Day. And the reason I'm here is to interview Dean Carnezis. Yes, that's right, the ultra marathon man. I've been talking about his book and what he does a lot lately on Facebook and Twitter. So the fact that I get to interview him today is really, really exciting. I can't wait to share that with you. Um, but for now, I'm going to take you on a little tour of the convention center so you can see some of the goodies that are out there for all you runners. Let's go take a look. I mean, they want to know what drives me to do these things. 
And when people ask me, uh, you know, what I don't tell them is that it's kind of the uh, supreme challenge of attempting to do something that I once would have thought was entirely impossible for a human being to do. Um, when people ask me what drives me to do these things, you know, what I don't tell them is that it's a, a deep curiosity I have to see how far the human body can go to really push and expand the limits of human endurance. And uh, when people ask me what drives me to do these things, you know, what I don't tell them is that it's, it's me. It's my way of being my best. It's, it's what I love to do. Um, I tell these people the honest truth. I mean, I run these 100-mile races uh, because of all the free food I get at the aid stations. Right? Like you guys, tomorrow. For energy bars, goose, and fruit that people cut for you, right? And you get the free race t-shirt. That was the main reason I came down here, because I've got a daughter at home, and um, she's young, and I think our clothing budget exceeds the national debt. So I figured, you know, I'll run and get a free t-shirt and save a little bit on, uh, on clothes, but my plan is always backfire, because she won't touch these things. She tells me they don't smell good. And I always say, half of them have never even been put on before. I mean, what do you mean they don't smell good? She said, Dad, they still don't smell good. And I can't wear the shirt because I didn't run the marathon. I'm smarter than that, she tells me. There are cars these days, Dad. Um, but seriously, uh, it's, it's a great supreme honor to be standing here and have so many people, you know, awaiting me. Uh, I had no idea when I turned that corner I'd walk into a group of people. I'm probably uh, not smelling too good and probably in need of a shower. And um, how many of you tomorrow are, are running the marathon? <laughs> and how many of you are buying a beer for me at the finish? Now the pizza thing, let me, let me tell you a little things. Uh, a couple things that I've learned over the years. Um, if you're gonna order pizza out on the run, get the Hawaiian style. The pepperoni's too spicy. So order the Hawaiian style. This is what you do, you order the Hawaiian style, you ask them not to slice it, and you get the thin crust. And then when they deliver it, you roll into this big, like, log, with this big burrito, and you know as you run. It's so good. It gets all over you, but it's so good. Yeah, it's great deal. I do weight training. I, I don't. I um, I also I windsurf and I surf and I rock climb and mountain bike. So I do a lot of um, strength training, cross training. But I, I don't necessarily. I don't, I, I don't like the, I don't like being inside, so I don't go to a gym. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, the question is: Do I have a pretty intense uh, stretching regimen? Regimen. And I, I'll be honest, um, I don't stretch. Yeah, I mean, I don't advocate not stretching, I just, I don't stretch. I think Jack Lane had a, a great quote, he said, have you ever seen a lion stretch? Um, but, uh, you know, I, my guidance is to, you know, listen to everyone, follow no one. Because I, I train and race with guys that I think are phenomenal runners, I, you know, much more, much faster than I am, and they stretch a whole lot. Some of them, some of them are like me, they don't stretch, so. I think just do what works best for you.